once upon a time. Hey guys, this is Dr. John from Life Church at Ardsley Park. And today I was thinking about how most stories for children begin. It begins with the phrase, once upon a time. And from there, some epic adventure begins. The story takes off and goes in a hundred different directions and it's always exciting to watch. But the question is, did the characters always know that they were in some epic story? Did a voice come over a loudspeaker and say, once upon a time? Certainly not. See, for the characters in the story, it started as a seemingly ordinary day that led to something greater. You've probably heard that God has plans for your life, but those plans are more than just general plans. God has specific plans for your life for once upon this time. In the book of Esther, we find the story of a young woman who God was going to use for a specific purpose for a specific time, but she had to be reminded that God had plans for her life. In chapter four, verse 14 of that book, her uncle reminds her, who knows, perhaps you have come to your royal position for such a time as this. See, God had a plan for that moment of her life, but this didn't just apply to Esther, and it didn't just apply to that moment. God has a plan for every moment of your life, so we search to find what it is that God is willing to do right now, once upon this time. So whether your life is taking you on some epic adventure, or you just need to have a conversation about Jesus with a friend, You only need to recognize that God is working and embrace how he is willing to use you. So today, become a part of the adventure. Take on your once upon this time. Maybe having a gospel conversation with a friend or sharing the love of Jesus or growing in your own personal relationship with God, whatever it is, Take advantage of this time. Well, I hope that this has been encouraging to you. If so, as always, like, tag a friend, and share this video. And I'll be back next week with another two minutes. Ish. Ha ha ha!